Hey guys, welcome back to Tony's How To's. In this video, I'll be showing you how to use Partner Eyes. Before we start, hurry up and check out our latest offer just under this video. So let's get started. So Partner Eyes is like a matchmaking service, for, but for businesses and people who want to team up and promote each other. So imagine you have a cool YouTube channel for a blog and you want to make money by promoting products or services. So Partner Eyes helps you find awesome companies to partner with. Now, how does it actually work? So one of them is connecting with brands. So Partner Eyes lets you connect with all sorts of companies and brands. So if you're into fashion, you might not uh, you might connect with clothing brands like Nike or Zazzle, or if you're into travel, you might partner with companies like Expedia or British British Airways. Now Another thing or how Partner Eyes work here is through powerful tools. Now it's called a partnership powerhouse because it offers everything you need to manage your partnerships. You can track how many people click on your links, manage your payments, and protect yourself from fraud. Also, they have an affiliate program. In this case, if you're interested in joining the affiliate program, which basically means promoting products for a commission, Partner Eyes is perfect. So you can apply to join program from different companies, but they might not accept everyone. So you need to take that in account. Also, you have the option to set up your account here. Now, another thing you need to or the Partner Eyes actually offers here is to actually explore campaigns. Now, in this case, uh, once you create your account, you have the capabilities of exploring campaigns and all the available tools they have. But in this case, how do we start leveraging the tools or the offers that Partnerize actually offers us? Well, first things first, go to the official website, which is going to be partnerize.com. And from here, what we need to do is we need to go to the very bottom. So in this case, at the very bottom of here, you should be able to see the partner section. Let's go ahead and click on it. Now, what we need to do is we now need to join their platform. Let's go ahead and click on join Partnerize. Now from here, what we need to do is we need to provide some information about yourself. Like for example, the email address we want to use for our account, the confirmation of that email address, a username, a password, and the confirmation of that password. So in this case, let's go and provide all those details. Now on the next page, you need to now provide your address. So that includes your country, your company address, address two up to four, and you have the post or zip code here, and as well as a number they want to associate with your account. In this case, it's going to provide all those details. Now, on the following page here, or in the next pages, you're now going to need to pre fill up the vertical, partner type, website URL, and company name. In this case, for the vertical section, you could choose one of the following, which is going to be accessories, automotive, a baby, books, and media. So in this case, it's going to be your niche. So for example, maybe I'm into, let's just say, clothing and apparel. And from here, we need to choose our partner type. So in this case, this might be a brand, buy now, pay later, content, or comparison review. So just to give an example, maybe I want to choose the option here for, let's just say this is going to be a display or slash media. In this case, we now need to provide a website URL as well as the company name. So for example, this is going to be my company name here. So let's just say it is going to be this one. But yeah, so in this case, go ahead and enter your website URL here and you need to also agree to the terms and conditions that they have. Now, if you want to read this, just click on accept terms and condition here and you should be able to read it further. But once you're done, just click on close at the top right here. And once you provide your website URL and confirm that you're human, you should be able to access the sign up button here and proceed on creating your account. But for now, let's go ahead and fill out all the missing details here. Now, once you've submitted that, it's going to say verification email sent. In this case, let's go ahead and open up our email address here. So let's just say it is going to be gmail.com here since I use my Gmail account. And from here, let's go ahead and look for the partnerized email here. And you should be able to see the link. Let's go ahead and click on it for you us to actually uh, verify your account or confirm our account here. So in this case, it's going to say email address verified. So let's go ahead and click on lock in partnerize. From here, just provide your username as well as your password and verify that you're human for you to log in into your account. So let's go ahead and do that. Now, once you've created your account, this is the first thing that you'll see here on the Partnerize. Now, at the very top, there are going to be different sections that you can access here. You have dashboard, campaigns, tracking, content, analytics, and payments. Now, in the dashboard section, this will actually contain the general idea or general information about your account. That includes your performance, your campaigns that you're invited to, the payments that you receive. So in this case, there will be the available funds for withdrawal and confirm payments as well. Now you should also be able to see the top 10 campaigns on your account as well as top 10 products as well. Now, if you want to switch over to a different publisher, you could go ahead and do this, but as you can see, I only have one. 
Now, if you want to uh, basically campaign or, or basically access your settings, you can go and click on Partnerize here and just click on the Settings option. Or if you want to need or if you need assistance, you can go and click on Help. Now, if you want to track your campaign, go ahead and click on Campaign Tracking here. Now, in this case, let's go ahead and go back into the dashboard. Now, in this case, at the top right, you should be able to see a bell icon. So the bell icon will contain your notifications. So for example, if you're invited to a specific campaign, this is where you'll be able to uh, basically see it immediately or any other notifications that you need to be informed of about on your account. Now, if you click on the light bulb here, it is actually the resource center. Now, obviously, platform or the portrait platform here obviously offers a lot. So having an assistant here or a resource center, which in this case you could refer to just in case you lose or something or forgot something, you should be able to read about it in their resource center. Now, what about we, the other sections here? Now, we also have the payment section. Now, payment section would contain your payments. So what about payments here? Well, in this case, there are actually a whole process here on uh, receiving payments. So we have uh, the statuses pending, approved, confirmed, and available. So first, if you have an ongoing uh, campaign, your payments here will be first and pending. But once a uh, specific company or a client here actually approves your pending transactions or your payment here, it will be converted to approve. But in this case, once it's actually approved, it needs to go to confirm first. And once it's actually confirmed and is now ready for a withdrawal, it's all going to be in the available section. Well, in this case, if you want to withdraw funds, just click on the withdraw button here. In this case, you'll have the option to filter out a few things here. Like for example, track currency, currency view as request currency here and request date and release date and the status of your payments here. Now, if you want to view the transaction queries here, just click on transaction queries. In this case, it will contain all your transactions. Now, payment settings here allows you to add your bank for withdrawals that you want to do. In this case, you can go and click on add bank here, and from then on, just follow the steps for you to add your bank. Now, analytics will contain different information about your account, like for example, your clicks, conversion, conversion items, total order value, and commission. So in this case, if you want to view more or have an idea how you're doing, analytics is a tab that you need to go to. Now content, we contain all the contents for your account here. So it actually depends on your campaigns. Now tracking here allows you to track your campaigns, which in this case, as you can see, it's actually pretty empty here because we first need to view our campaigns and join a campaign. So let's go ahead and click on campaigns. Now from here, we have two tabs and campaigns. So you have the campaigns, your campaigns and commissions. So campaigns that you've already joined to. But if you want to join two campaigns, just click on join campaigns here. And from here, you could go ahead and choose whatever option here. You also have the option to view the currency that they have already offer. So for example, we have Bodega Veneta here, which is in this case is going to be Euro. Now for example, maybe I want to say 23 and me here. We want to apply for that. Let's go and click on this one. Now, like what I said before, or what we said before, uh, not all campaigns here will accept everybody. So there's a whole approval process here, which in this case, let's go and select this one. And from here, we also want to actually agree to the terms and conditions here for Trinity and Me affiliate program. In this case, you could go and click on view terms and conditions to what are those. So it's really important that you read their terms and service here or agreements just to make sure that you are not going against them just in case you do something online. So in this case, if you do something against their terms and agreement here or conditions, you might lose access on the specific campaign here. In this case, once you've selected this one, you could go and click on the join selected campaigns here. And from here, it's going to uh, redirect you to another page here. So as you can see, when we go back into campaigns and to join campaigns here, as you can see, we've now requested access or we've now requested to join the campaign for 23 and me. So it's actually pretty easy on joining a different uh, campaigns here and partnerize. And yeah, so using partnerize here is actually pretty straightforward and you won't have to worry much on how to use it. But in this case, once they actually approve your application here, you should be able to start using partnerize for your affiliate program. And that's about it. So if you found this video helpful, hit the like and subscribe button and watch our next video.